So this has been the best couple of days ever. Um, I got my my package from Jeanette uh, from Miss Hootie's Crafts. I just I couldn't even believe that. Um, and then today I got a message from my bestie Sandy Duda from Leftist Right Crochet saying that there's a package at the post office um, that I have to go pick up. And she says, take a buggy or a trolley or something. I was like, hmm? Now, disclaimer here. If anybody is going to try sending me something, um, please do not send it to my shop. Uh, apparently there's rules and, and whatnot in place. Um, and it's impossible for us to get our packages. So <clears throat> unless it's coming by courier, um, please don't send anything through the post office to my shop. So, <clears throat> um, sorry, I got customers coming in. Hold that thought. Can I just say I really hate it when people come in and take a real close look at my work and try to copy it. <laughs> anyway, I digress. <clears throat> um, yeah, so anyways, um, in order for me to get a package at my shop, I have to go through the owners who have the key and uh, it's pretty much not allowed to have vendors putting stuff through their mailbox. So, um, if if there was something that you wanted to send me, please email me and I will give you an address that you can send it to. <clears throat> uh, because I almost didn't get these. They weren't going to give them to me. So, um, so yeah, anyway. So my bestie says, okay, so there's a package for you. I get there and there's two pack, two boxes. Now these boxes are big. I had to end up calling Miles from the shop across to come and help me. <laughs> Um, yeah, I, I, I just can't even, I opened up the top of the first box and I stopped immediately and said, I have to video this because holy cow, you guys, my bestie really loves me. <laughs> oh, wow. The first thing I see in the box is this touch of yak. I have never touched yak yarn. Um, this, oh, this looks so cool. And I am praying that this is not going to be like an alpaca thing that I'm allergic to because I will be crushed. So, oh my God, it's so soft. It is so soft. Um, okay. So this is 219 yards, 200 meters. It's a medium four weight. It's 90% acrylic, 10% yak. And you guys, it is so soft. It is so soft. Look at that. Um, this is alabaster. And this is by, it's by Touch of Lux Lion Brand Yarn. So, so you can see the touch of Lux. Oh, this is so nice. Wow. That is amazing. And I got three of them. <laughs> Yay! Oh, there's a lot here, guys. I hope you have your coffee. Um, she said that it's kind of a mismatch of different yarns, like one-offs and, and, you know, stuff like that. So, the second one that I saw is this Bella Coco Crochet Piece piece of Cake DK. Look at those colors. Oh, look at these colors. Oh, yeah, I had a feeling when I looked at it, it has wool in it. Now, it's 25% alpaca, 25% wool, and 50% premium acrylic. And... Where's the little thingies? It's 100 grams, 310 meters, and the number is 3.1. I'm not sure what that is. I knew as soon as I looked at it that it had to have wool in it, so, so that's going to be a shop yarn. 
It is so pretty. Ugh. Okay, so I got two of those. Whoops. So that's going to go in the shop. Uh, this one is a Bella Coco. Oh, hang on. We got customers. Okay, it's the same company. And this color is Elm. And it's 25% wool, 75% premium acrylic. And there's 100 grams and 120 meters. 100 gram. Is that the same? Same? No. So there's that. And I got one of those. No, sorry, two of those. Two of those. So we'll put those over there. Um, what else have we got in here? Holy cow. Here's some more Bella Coco. This is, oh, this is acrylic. <laughs> so that's good. Okay, so it's Bella Coco. Look at that color. It's 100% premium acrylic. And this color is Bon Bon. That is really pretty. Looks like she's sent me a few Bella Cocos. So this is, this color is... Where's the color? Oh, it just gives me the color of 11586. So there's those. And, oh my goodness. And then there's little Bella Cocos. Uh, do, 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 do. Where does it say? Okay, it's acrylic. This is a 25 gram ball at 66 meters. And this shade is 999. Of course, it's white. And then there's a pink. Oh, this one's different. Hang on. This one's. Mm, the shade is 784. Eight, Little mini bonbons. Chicka bonbon, chicka bonbon. Um, okay, so now we've got Crafters Square. If I'm. If, if if memory serves me right, which is entirely, you know, depends on the day. The Crafter Square Acrylic, I believe, is this is in the States Dollar Store. This, I believe, is the yarn that she used for um, my grandson's baby blanket, and it came out amazingly soft. It was so squishy. So I was telling her I really wished that you know, we could get this up here, but she sent me a bunch. <laughs> so this color is, uh, 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 where's the color? I know it's gotta be here somewhere. It doesn't tell me the color. And if it does, I can't see it. Anyways, it's blue and pink. Um, Oh, we've got some more. Oh, these are different. These are called little ones. This is acrylic. So these, oh, these are called little ones. Uh, these are also Bella Coco. So, um, is there any more Bella Coco? Oh, there's one Bella Coco. And this is called Crystal Decay. Look at the sparkle in that. Oh, so pretty. This is called Rose Quartz. Okay. This is 98% uh, premium acrylic and 2% metallic. Okay. Um, and then there's another one. Bella Coco. Oh, wow. Look at the sparkle on that. Oh, wow. That's pretty. This is called Hopal. Wouldn't those two go really nice together? Oh, so nice. Oops. Oh, hello. Uh, okay. Then we got some Just Cotton. And blue. Okay. Oh, I'm running out of room already. We aren't even halfway through the first box. Then we've got Just Yarn Worsted in blue. You can sure tell. I mean, this this is one of Sandy's favorite colors, right? So <laughs> That's so funny. 
Okay. Um, oh, Ahuga. Oh, this this was my go-to um, yarn for quite some time. I love Ahuga yarn. This is teal. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. All right. <clears throat> and Miles is coming to bug me. Hang on. Okay. Sorry about that. Uh, where was I? Oh, okay. So this is Lion Brand Cotton Candy Blend. Look at those colors. That totally reminds me of cotton candy. That, or, um, candy canes. But it's got yellow in it, so. That's that. This is, why would they call this white? Because it's not white. Well, I mean, it's white, but it's got... I don't understand that. Um, there is 271 yards, 248 meters. It's 52% polyester and 48% cotton. So I got three of those. Uh, <laughs> not sure where I'm going to put all this. Oh, crap. Um... What's this? Oh, oh, look at this. Oh, baby, organic. This is cute. Okay. Uh, this is a lion brand. 50 grams, uh, 180 yards, 165 meters. It's 100% organic cotton. It's actually a darker color than this. It's like that. Um, and it's called Coral. That's really pretty. It's really pretty. Okay. Oh, this looks familiar. <laughs> I love Charisma. Okay. I've made lots of scooties out of this. Um, and for those of you that don't know what a scooty it is, is, it's a hooded cowl and the pattern is in my Etsy shop. <laughs> which is linked down below. Shameless plug. Um, yeah, this makes a really nice scooty. I love this. This color is Spiced Market. Oh, okay. This is really cool. This is called... Oh, and, and Sandy told me, just finished telling me because I FaceTimed her and was like, what the heck did you send me? Um, she was just telling me that she saw on a couple of websites or a couple of YouTube channels that they're talking about the Hobby Lobby sale coming up again. Like the big sale. I thought they did that like in June or something. So, yikes. Um, okay, this is Sweet Divinity. Yarn Be Sweet Divinity. And this is called Red Clay. Yarn Be Sweet Divinity. And the yardage is 100 grams, 243 yards, 222 meters. And it's 80% acrylic, 20% cotton. And she sent, <laughs> she sent me a few. This one, <laughs> she sent me a little note in this one. I apologize for this one being uh, uh, rewound. As you can tell, they got very loose and kept coming apart. They have not been used. <laughs> That's okay. I can put it on my winder thing. <laughs> the, <laughs> the last time she sent me yarn um, was for, was it a Christmas? I can't remember if it was um, for the Christmas, for our Christmas gift exchange. <laughs> <laughs> she sent me the Arabella yarn and it looked like it had a party in the box. It was such in dis such disarray. It was hilarious. So I ended up rewinding it. <laughs> but it was just it was unbelievable. So she sent me <clears throat> four of this color. And oh Ooh, ooh! This I can use on my scooties for sure. Um, this is called um, Lovey, 
and it is Lion Brand. I think this is a discontinued yarn. Um, but yeah, this is this can be used on on scooties. It's so squishy soft. Oh, I just had a customer ask me about this uh, yesterday because I don't have any in the shop. But this is Bernat Velvet. I love this stuff. But it's, um, ugh, I gotta bring some in. Uh, this is Burgundy Plum. Love it. And this one is Vapor Gray. Yes. Oh, love it. Okay. This is Red Heart with Love Metallic. Ooh, look at that. Um, this is called Royal. And it's a medium four. And where's the stats? I don't know, it's premium acrylic. Where's the stats? Oh, 200 yards, 183 meters. Yeah. Isn't that pretty though? That is so pretty. Oh, and look at this. Sent me, oh, oh. <laughs> what would you send me? Look at Stinker Bell. Stinker. basically just saying it's up to me what I want to do with the yarn if I want to keep it or put it in the shop. <laughs> like, okay. okay so now I'm gonna try and undo this package. Um, hold that thought. Okay so this is called Zephyra. It's 55% cotton, 27% wool, and 18% acrylic. Look at this color. Isn't that beautiful? And there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven in here. So, there we go. Now that's the first box. Let's open the second box. Okay. <laughs> so, she sent me a card. I love you too. It says, hey brat. <laughs> I call, she calls me brat and I call her bat. Uh, she says, hope you can use this stuff to sell in your shop. If it's not appropriate for selling, feel free to use, your, use it yourself or re-gift it. Uh, love you tons and sweet wishes for a mega success in your store. Uh, the old bat and posse. She says, P.S. Octavia sends kisses. I send kisses back. <laughs> okay. So I think this is what she was talking about. She said that she... Oh, hold on. Okay. So I think this is what she was talking to me about. Um, she was saying that one of my Christmas gifts from last year was in here. And I think this is what she meant. And I didn't realize until I opened it that it was supposed to be an advent, I think. And I just rubbed it right open. <laughs> so anyways, it's a geological kit of mixed gemstones. So. I just ripped it right away. Can't do this without you guys, without it falling. So. There's lots of different different types of stones in here. There's, there's like fluorite. And. Sorry, crinkly. Tiger's eye. And there's carnelian. Raw carnelian. There's, oh gosh, there's lots. There's, um, oops, rose quartz and Apache and obsidian and crystal quartz and hematite and like, lots. Adventuring. Yeah, there's lots of them in here. If I, if I push this up, it's going to dump all of the things. <laughs> so, yeah, that's going to be cool. I'm going to put them all in a dish. 
and I'm going to put them in, at my desk for good positive energy. Oh, buttons! Oh, look at these cute buttons. Oh, I'm going to put those on some baby sweaters. Oh, those are so cute. They're all wood buttons. They're all different kinds. Oh, those are really cute. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to put those on baby sweaters. Okay. <laughs> so, we have, oh, we've got a Mandela Ombre. Love this color. It's like jean. It's called Harmony. Very cool. Love that. Um, oh, did I not just finish saying that I love homespun? This is old. This is old, old homespun. This is um, like from way, way back. Take this tag off. Hang on. <laughs> this one I'm keeping for sure. Because this is like, it's an old label. Yeah, this is some, um, this is old school homespun. But I love these colors together. Like, it's got like a beige and a pink and a green. I am gonna, I'm gonna make, yeah, I'm gonna make a sweater, a baby, put this in a baby, put this in a baby sweater as an accent. Definitely, yes. Um, oh, she sent me some more of this. <laughs> she sent me a whole bunch of this stuff. And I love it. It's called Purely Fresh. Yarn be Purely Fresh. And I don't even know if I can say this. It's called Peacockle. <laughs> no kidding. See? Peacockle. <laughs> oh my god. I need coffee or something. <laughs> So there's the color she sent me. One, two, three, four. Oh my goodness. Five, six, seven, eight. So far there's eight. <laughs> so. Ta-da! Very cool. Peacockle. That is terrible. Who names this stuff? <laughs> Okay, and then there's some ice yarns. This is Baby Summer Decay. Uh, I'm not sure if this is wool. It doesn't look like wool. It almost looks like cotton. Uh, let's see. It's... Yeah, it's cotton and acrylic. 50% cotton, 50% acrylic. Yeah. So, and there's four of these. And this cute little bag that I'm probably never going to get it back into. <laughs> and, oh, ooh, this is a nice color. This is, this is, this is, this is called Camilla Cotton. <clears throat> and it's ooh, thin, thin, thin. It's a bleed or 50 gram balls, yeah. Sorry, I totally just And there's three of those. That was weird. <laughs> Hold on. Sorry about that. Okay. What have we got now? Um ooh, wow. This is yarn bee color ideal. So it is called L is for lemon. Wow, that is bright. That is really bright. And I got one, two, three, four. She really knows how to pack a box. Five, six. So far, I think I've got six. So, <laughs> like, holy bright. Holy bright. Okay, whoops. I need room. I need room. I need room. Okay. Um. Ooh. I got soft and shiny loops and threads in my color. My, as you can tell, isn't that gorgeous? And it's squeaky. 
squeaky. So I got two of those. Hi. I am so sorry. <laughs> Why is it whenever a customer comes in, they, you know, they want something I don't have? <sighs> oh, can't please everybody, I guess. Okay, where am I at? Oh, I got some more of these. Um, oh, we've got a few of these. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> we've got at least four more. <laughs> Okay, um, then I've got Baby Darling Deer. Holy Hannah, is that thin? Wow. My goodness. Oh, put on your glasses, Sandy. Okay, this is called Pretty in Purple. Oh, I guess it is purple. It doesn't show, it looks like gray and white in here, but when I'm looking at it, yeah, it's got shades of purple in it. It's actually really pretty. Hmm, really pretty. Nope, this way. It is a light three. I would say it's even a two. 97% <laughs> um, acrylic, 3% polyester. No, sorry, polyamide. 100 grams, 295 yards, 270 meters. And yeah, I told you the color already. I've got two of those. Nope, three. Three, no, four. <laughs> oh, this one's different, I think. Oh, no, look at this. Look at the difference in the color. I wonder if you go deep in here, if there's more purple. Wow, look at that. Totally different. Oh, oh, here you don't want. Hold on. I'm never going to get through this video. <laughs> okay. So yeah, the colors are quite different. Yeah, interesting. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> Duh. That's because this one's different. <laughs> um, okay, so this one is called Paper and Strings. <laughs> And this one is called Pretty and Purple. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, oh, this is Moroccan Nights. And it is 250 meters, 273 yards, and it's acrylic and polyester. 98% acrylic, 2% polyester. I don't know if you're going to be able to see the sparkle. Oh, it's got it's got sparkle in it. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to see it. That's too bad because it's really pretty. But it's got shimmer through the dark part. Oh, there. You see that right there? Yeah. So I've got oh, I've got a few of these. One, two. Three. Oh, look, you can tell the color in this. Oh, look at that. Oh, there's even dark blue in that one. Oh, is this a different color? This one's called Scarab. Yep, Scarab. And Scarab. Yeah, they're all the same. Oh, look at that. That is so pretty. Okay. My goodness, girl. Look at all this stuff. Okay, this is um, 50% wool, 50% acrylic. I knew as soon as I looked at it, I was like, oh, mm. this is called Splendor Lindcraft. This is, and there's, it's a 50 gram ball. And I got one, two, hello. Hi. Okay, so it's been like an hour since I talked to you guys last. <laughs> okay, let's get this done. All right, so I got Splendor. Splendor? This is wool. It is... Did I already show this to you guys? I don't even remember. Um, 
It's a 50 gram ball. It's 50% wool, 50% acrylic. Very pretty. Very pretty. Oh, okay. We're almost done. <laughs> I got two amigurumi. This, the, this one came apart here. The two of the amigurumi um, rolls. What do you call these? Wagon wheels or something. <laughs> uh, and then I got yarn bee color. I can't pronounce this. Color Ideally in magenta. I got two of those. Um, oh, I've got some more. Oh, I've got a lot more of the um, Darling Deer in the purple color. This is the purple color too. Yeah. Oh, this is called Little Pig. My Little Piggy. Oops. Oh, oh. Let's do that. Uh, what's it called? This little piggy. It's got pink. You can kind of see pink. Um, I got quite a bit of this. This is my little piggy. And, oh. and this is the paper and string. Stringy ding ding. And my little piggy. And the paper and string. And the paper and string. So I got quite a bit of this, so that's good. What? What? Oh, did you talk? Yeah. Okay, we have ice cream yarn. Ice cream yarn. This is cotton ice cream yarn. It's 100 grams, 225 yards, 206 meters. And it's orange. Hello. Uh, we've got three of these. Look, it's got the, that one's got a lot of pink in it. It's interesting how you wind it and it looks so different. Winding out of room. And then I got the purple. It's called Great. So I've got that. Oh, I'm gonna have a yarn of lunch. I can just see it. And then, oh, oh, I've got rainbow yarn. I've had this before. This is from Hobie. And I think it's 50 gram balls. Yeah, 50 grams. It's um. Color, it's color 13. So I got those. Oh my god, you guys. And then I've got these. These are really pretty. Holy cow. Oops. This is. Fashion Cor Corsica? I don't know if I'm, and there's no way I'm ever going to pronounce that right. But look at those colors. Isn't that pretty? Like, oh, they're so pretty. And there's a shimmer in there. And I got three of those. Mm, three of those. Oops, my battery's dying. Oh, yeah, you too. Bye. Battery's dying. Hold on. Hey, Yarnabees. Okay, so my camera completely died on me uh, when I was doing my video. So, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, I was pretty much finished what was in the boxes anyway. <clears throat> but, um, yeah, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, I have to say a huge, huge, huge Thank you, and I love you with all my heart to my bestie, Sandy Duda at Left is Right Crochet. If you don't know who she is, I've got her link down below all the time. Um, hers and Jeanette's from Miss Hootie's Crafts. Um, and, you know, like those two are... The cat's ass, man. Those guys, those guys are just, they, they rock. Um, oh, yeah, I love those guys so much. I really do. There we go. Um, so anyways, I, like I, like I said, I was totally blown away and unexpected. Um, 
I was unexpected. Well, I'm always unexpected. <laughs> I, I was totally blown away and the boxes were completely unexpected. Um, she surprised the heck out of me, I tell you. Wow. But anyways, so I'm going to end this video. Um, and I will, the next video will be about the, the shop, the new shop. It's, it looks good, you guys. It really does. <clears throat> so anyways, okay. I love you all. And uh, we will talk to you soon. Okay. Bye. Bye.